Oh, until you complete Wednesday. Complete the analogies. Funny is to silly, as tired is to exhausted. This is one of those that you can put anything as long as it is a synonym of tired. Part is to blank, as north is to south. North and south are opposites, so the opposite of part is whole. The whole thing. Most is to least, those are antonyms, as blank is to female, should be male. Image is to picture, as object is to thing. If your student's having trouble with any of these, I always tell them just skip over it until we go over it together. It's fine. They should be able to answer most of these, but if they're getting stuck, please don't worry about it. It's okay. We're not gonna know everything. Write a sentence using the re relative pronoun, myself. So, um, I gave myself a pat on the back. I would probably really want this to be longer, but I ran out of room. As long as they made a sentence using myself and it makes sense, that's all we need here. Where's my books that I need to return to the library? Asked Martin. Okay, so he's actually saying this, so we do need these quotes, but we need to capitalize the first word inside the quote. Where is, so we do need that apostrophe. I'm sorry, no we don't, because it's multiple books. So we're actually gonna change this. Where are, where are my books that I need to return to the library? The question mark does not go after the, the dialogue tag. We need to move that inside our quotes Martin gets capitalized, and this changes to a period. You have questions on that? Please feel free to ask me. Sometimes the students get a little confused. That's okay. All right, homophones. The rodeo queen rode her horse all around the road that encircles the arena. So she rode her horse on the road. The cowboy was too hoarse to ride the trail on his horse. So he lost his voice. So that's that kind of horse. But he was riding on his horse, the animal. Okay, which sentence is correct? Independence Day is celebrated not in the United States, but also in the Philippines. Okay, so this is not correct. Let's see. We've got a comma and a conjunction, so we're going to circle that. Independence Day is celebrated not in the United States. Okay, is that a complete thought? Well, we have our subject, Independence Day, and we have our predicate, is celebrated. It doesn't really make a lot of sense, but technically it's correct. It's got that subject and predicate. Also in the Philippines. Okay, we have no subject here. What is also in the Philippines, we don't know. Um, so we're gonna put an X right there. That's not a complete thought by itself. If we have a check and an X on either side of our circles, we go one, 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 my job is done. However, we have two in the middle, so A cannot be correct. Independence Day is celebrated not only in the United States, but also in the Philippines. This word right here changes that whole sentence. All right, so let's go ahead and circle comma and conjunction. Independence Day is celebrated not only in the United States. Is that a complete thought by itself? Again, yes, Independence Day is. Um, also in the Philippines. Okay, we already said that wasn't. Again, this is kind of a tricky one, so we'll go ahead and put an X there, but you know, winky face will probably be back. <laughs> Independence Day is celebrated not only in the United States, we're good, just in the Philippines two. Okay. Just in the Philippines is not complete. Look at all these circles and everything going on. That's too much. If we were to read, if this happens, because this happens sometimes where you have all X's, 
When this happens, you go back through and you read the entire sentence all the way through without stopping. So Independence Day is celebrated not in the United States, but also in the Philippines. No, we still don't like it. Independence Day is celebrated not only in the United States, but also in the Philippines. Yes, that's something I would say to somebody. Independence Day is celebrated not only in the United States, just in the Philippines too. That does not make sense at all. B is your best answer. All right, guys, we got one more to go. Make sure the students complete Thursday before you get here. Analogies. Cause is to effect as fact is to opinion. 